Here we have today uh, the new motherboard um, for the Socket 1366 um, from Asus. It's called the Rampage 2 Extreme. Um, it's very much based on their old Rampage version, which, if it's anything to live up to its uh, predecessor, um, then all motherboard manufacturers will have um, a board to follow um, throughout the coming years. Um, as we can see here, it's got a list of options. Um, we've got XFI, um, sand on it. Uh, we've got uh, six channels there for memory. I believe it's 12 gigabytes of memory that can go into this. Um, let's unbox it and have a closer look. You can see from first off it's uh, beautifully packaged. Okay, and this is the uh, beauty we're talking about. As I said before, we've got a tri-channel here. A maximum of uh, 12 gigabytes can go in there, but for today, we're going to be using uh, just tri-channel, um, three gigabyte memory. South bridge, um, north bridge, but the memory controller's not on this now. It's actually in the CPU. Um, we've got an endless amount of USB ports and various other ports, um, reset buttons, clear comms. Um, unlike any other motherboard um, or its predecessor, where if you wanted to run NVIDIA cards, you would have to buy a motherboard suitable for that, or if AMD, you'd have to buy a motherboard suitable for that. Um, now we've got three PCI Express slots that this is capable of running either NVIDIA or AMD cards, so it's actually going to save money in the long run. Um, nice little feature, as with the old Rampage board, we've got the tweak it function which we can adjust um, various voltages, front side bus, um, or multiplier even on this one now. Um, but the most exciting bit for me is the, uh, the voltage measuring points that we can measure true voltages, um, not reading through bars anymore, and uh, a screen what that tells us can be right, you know, um, the coding could not be right, so we could be 100 millivolts out or so. We actually got hardwired measure points that we can actually measure the voltage of the RAM or a CPU, etc. Um, so that's the motherboard. As with all Asus products, you get an endless amount of uh, kit with the products. Here we have the LCD poster which plugs into the board and as I was saying about the tweak it function we can adjust the front side bus or the voltage. This tells us all what's going on with the motherboard. Um, we've got a nice creative uh, Supreme FX sand card there. Lots of uh, SATA leads, power leads, uh, IDE cable. We've got a couple of bridges here for freeway SLI or two-way SLI, um, back panel, various other I.O. ports and bits, um, a couple of thermal probes that can be attached to the board in various places, again that we can read the temperature through the LCD uh, monitor. We've got the user guide and again insulation CD and a couple of easy adapting plugs that uh, literally plug onto there. Um, the idea is that when you're installing this in the case, you connect on, you know, your start, reset and that. They're all connected, then you can just quickly plug them onto the board. So it's ease of installation. Another brilliant idea from Asus. Um, all to and all, it's looking like a fantastic product. And today, hopefully, uh, we'll see what we can do with it with some liquid nitrogen.